I grew up in, on a farm in upstate New York and uh, I went to a small school, I mean, where there were all 12 grades and <laughs> only. And uh, it was a very healthy environment. I did a lot of outdoor activity, of course. And my mother uh, taught for a while. She didn't go to college, but she at that time they had what they called normal school. And uh, she uh, taught for a while. And I think at that time, teaching was about the only profession that uh, most women went to, so I don't think that they had expectations of me being a lawyer or <laughs> a doctor. No one in my parents' generation went to college, but they were always very uh, determined that I would and that uh, I would get an education. And so basically, during my childhood, they let me be a student. They, I was not uh, working on the farm all the time. I you know, had to pitch in when hay uh, <laughs> reaping time came, but uh, basically I, uh, I, I was a student. I graduated from college with a major in philosophy and had a difficulty getting a job in Boston <laughs> with the philosophy major who couldn't type. <laughs> And so I, I did eventually uh, get a job with the government, but I did determine that I would like to have a profession. And the only one that I had the prerequisites for was law. So I went to, I applied to law school, got in, and um, it was really serendipitous, but when I got there, I decided this is where I should have been all along, and I really enjoyed law school.